Behind the gate, second division, Lady Ma. A trace of magic, Lady McBeach. Search for Shannon, Castanet Hall. Love my Lisa, cathedra.com. There they go. Often pacing, that's Lady McBeach going right out for the lead on the outside. Cathedra.com second, the end of the turn. Search for Shannon gets away third. Trace of Magic is fourth, racing fifth. Castanet Hall treading the field. Love my Lisa as they race around the turn, going to the first quarter mark. Field of three year old Philly Pacers going to the first quarter mark. Gets Lady McBeach and Bill Fay. Opening quarter 26 and 4. He entered the lane, passing his hand to the first time, coming to the 3 8 mark. A search for Shannon is second. Cathedra.com pacing third. Trace of Magic is fourth. Castanet Hall tips to the outside, wants a cover, and he's going to get it from a Trace of Magic. He entered the turn, moving up on the inside. Love my Lisa. We got four in, two out, going to the halfway point. 56 and four. Second quarter, 30 seconds flat racing to the back side lady mcbeach on top search for shannon second racing third cathedra.com fourth on the outside a trace of magic three wide on the outside here comes casting that hall cathedra.com is buried down the back side going to the three-quarter mark coming to the outside love my lisa going to the three-quarter mark it's lady mac beach the leader at the three quarters 125 and four backside and 29 a little more than an eight to go lady mac beach with the lead casting at home moves up on the outside second racing third love my lisa cathedra.com five wide on the outside coming to the wire cathedra.com on the outside love my lisa second cathedra.com love my lisa second casting at home was third one 55 and two or six cathedra.com CDC Stables of Old Forge, Pennsylvania. Chris Ryder's second training victory of the season here at the Meadows. David Miller getting his third win of the year at the Meadows. Cathedra.com, three-year-old Philly, but presidential ball to Cathedra. Gets the 18th win and 35 lifetime starts. Earnings now in excess of $1,110,000. Winner tonight, 155 and 2, final half 58 and 3, final quarter 29 and 3. Pennsylvania Racing Commissioner Ed Rogers at the winner's circle for the presentation, along with Tracy Bittner, marketing department, presenting the trophy and blanket to Cathedra.com. Winning trainer Chris Ryder and winning driver David. Miller! That is Miller's 17th stakes win of his racing career at the Meadows. Number six, cathedra.com. I decided to sit there and wait for the stretch. I figured I'd get loose, hopefully. What then was the winning move? What did you do to get her out and rolling so uh, magnificently in the middle of the racetrack? Uh, well, what got me out was when uh, uh, the one horse died off in the last turn and I was able to get out on Pierce's back and then uh, she brushed home then. Congratulations, David. Let me uh, ask you to step aside. Chris Ryder, a New Zealander, a good friend who has another fine filly here. She is a bit of a delicate filly. You take some, uh, some care with her in her training regimen? Well, we take as much care as humanly possible. Um, we don't train her a heck of a lot. We try to keep her fresh because I know she's got a long year and it's uh, pretty much getting close to being over, but uh, we, uh, we're just having a real good time with her. We've seen two outstanding fillies win here. We asked the winner of the First Division, Bunny Lake, if they're coming back for more at age four, how about cathedral.com? Will she be back the races? Uh, the, yes, bottom line. We expect that we will be, definitely yes. Chris, congratulations on a great win here today. Thank you very much. Gentlemen, we've seen a great Philly race, a companion event to the Messenger, has found a home here at the Meadows. We hope it makes a great co-feature for the Messenger. Well done, Meadows, and well done to the winner of two uh, great divisions here this evening, gentlemen.